Inspectors have found small, subsurface cracks in three more Southwest Airlines planes that are similar to the cracks suspected of causing this jetliner, a Boeing 737-300, to make an emergency landing Friday. Sunday, Southwest released a statement saying that cracks had been discovered in two of its planes, and a federal inspector later told the AP that a third Southwest plane had been found with cracks developing. These photos show the hole that opened up in the roof of the Boeing 737-300 that was bombed for Sacramento from Phoenix Friday. Good morning. Sunday, NTSB said there was a five-foot-long tear along a riveted joint that shows extensive cracking, cracking that mechanics would have had difficulty spotting unless they were looking for it. A preliminary on-site examination reveals pre-existing fatigue along the entire fracture surface. Sunday, the damaged section of the plane was removed. It's being sent to Washington, where it will be analyzed along with information from the plane's flight recorders. An AP review of FAA records on this particular plane shows that an inspection in March 2010 found 10 instances of cracking in the aircraft frame and another 11 instances of cracking stringer clips, which help hold the plane together. The records show that the cracking was either repaired or the damaged parts were replaced. Over the weekend, Southwest canceled hundreds of flights as it inspected dozens of its 737-300s. And the Southwest says those inspections should be finished by late Tuesday, which means more cancellations are likely until all the planes are back in the air. Brian Thomas, the Associated Press.